you have a piece in the Atlantic about sort of the fallout from the Hobby Lobby decision? The Supreme Court said that Obamacare had to carve out essentially for a Christian-run business. If the owners of that business don't want to provide certain contraceptive services, they can do that. And, and you right now, there's pressure on the White House when it comes to gay rights. Explain. Well, so this is coming not from the religious right, but sort of from the religious left. These are religious groups that are generally friendly from the White House and have worked with Obama. And they're saying, you know, now that the court said we needed this carve out for Hobby Lobby, here's another carve out that, that we want. The president has announced he's going to issue an executive order banning uh, sexual orientation discrimination by federal contractors, discrimination against gays and lesbians. Uh, and the religious groups are saying there needs to be a religious exemption in this executive order when it comes out. So places like religious social social service organizations uh, can follow their beliefs. They're saying Hobby Lobby shows that the administration needs to be a little bit more sensitive to the prerogatives of religious groups. The first piece of the fallout, this will continue. Maggie, Molly, thanks for coming in this morning. As we get back to you guys in New York, that piece, I just tweeted it out. If you want to read it on The Atlantic, find us on Twitter.